Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. Today I will show you how you can use autocomplete text box with fuzzy search in the WPF. So let's create a WPF project .NET framework next and give it a name autocomplete text box wpf dot net and click create so first of all go to github and you will see that repository wpf toolkit and here you will click that input toolkit and I will copy I will copy that package manager command and go to my project and open package manager console and paste that command so it will install the library and I will be able to use that library so after installing go to your main window and start so let's create a stack panel instead of grid stack panel orientation vertical and use control auto complete now press uh, uh, control dot and add that namespace add decimal namespace so it will be completed so now you have included a auto complete text box in the WPF and now I will give it a name name will be TB and I will go to its code behind file with F7 and here I will define a list of string it can be list of string or any tb dot item source is equal to new string I will give it some names Ali Raza Farhan Rashid and Rizwan Rashid so this is the item source that I have set now I will start that project and run it the WPF application so I will search with the Ali you can see it is showing me Ali I can search for Farhan Farhan Rashid Rizwan Rashid So as you can see when once I will start typing the first part of the name it is showing me that full name but if I am uh, typing the last part of the name it is not showing me that full name so let's see I will choose Ali it is showing me if I will uh, type Raza it is not showing me anything so let's resolve that issue for this tb dot filter mode is equal to auto complete filter mode dot contains so here I am changing the filter mode that it is contains so if any part of that input is contained inside that item source it will show the results let's see if I will choose uh, if I will type Raza it is showing me Ali Raza if I am choosing Rashid it is showing me Farhan and Rizwan Rashid so this is a full tip and I will post that project to the github so simply you can use it 
create git repository 